Look at me, I'm such a mess. Hi, I'm Michael. Uh, this is day 10 of a three week long series where I'm writing a song. So 10 days ago, I sat down, turned on the camera and said, I'd like to write a song. And 10 days later, I've got a nice song going on. So that part has been great. Um, in yesterday's video, on day nine, I reviewed what I had so far. What I have so far are two verses and a bridge. Two verses and, anyway, two verses and a bridge. Um, and I mentioned yesterday that I could probably just repeat one of the verses and fade out, call it a song, um, and that would be perfectly fine by me. I'm happy with it. It's a nice song, um, and I could play it out, and people would go, that's a nice song. So, yay. However, I want to put a little bit more into it. I definitely want a third verse. I want to wrap up the ideas in the song. Um, and in point of fact, I've already written the first line to the third verse, but that's all I did. Um, mainly because I have a few other things that I want to get to first. And one of the things that I want to get to is the transition from the verses to the bridge. What I'm doing right now is kind of holding on this chord. This is an A chord, I'm on the second fret capoed at the second fret. This is a G shape, but at the second fret, it becomes an A. And there's that. And I do this. And to go into the bridge, I'm just holding this for two measures. And then I do this. That's fine, I've got no problem with that. Uh, on days when I I'm, might not be feeling my chops, my fingers are cold or I'm tired, I can play it that way and it will sound fine. However, I want to put a little bit more polish on the song. So this morning uh, I reached out to my friend Nick, um, who's also on YouTube, YouTube uh, one guitarist. And I said, hey, uh, you got any ideas? And once he figured out what I was doing, he had lots of ideas. Um, and it was awesome to kind of get his feel for what's going on. Um, and a lot of the ideas I liked, I kind of put them through my filter. And the one thing that I'm gonna do, uh, he mentioned the bridge I'm holding up here, pretty much through the whole song. Um, and it gets to be a little bit too much, especially for the bridge. Uh, so he suggested playing it without that for the bridge, and I like it, but the melody really needs this. So what I decided to do was kind of walk up to it. Alright, and that works. So now the problem that I'm faced with is going from here to here. So here to here, which basically is A to G. Um, and I'm not sure that I need chords. Uh, and the whole song I'm kind of messing around with. Let's see, I'm holding it for two measures. I could... Try that. Maybe it's that easy. Let's try. Let's try again. Uh, I 
like that. So that takes me from F sharp then down to the E, C sharp to the D, that's the fifth, and then That'll work. Um, when I'm holding it before going into the bridge and playing it, I'm going two measures. I probably want to do this twice. Okay, that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, that makes total sense. That's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to have to practice the transition so I get smooth with it. Um, but no, that transition works for me. Um, and already I've got ideas about, oh, I could do stuff on top of that, um, do stuff below it. Yeah, that works. So, good. Thanks, Nick. Um, I'm going to let it go here for tonight and get back at it tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow I've got open mic at the dovetail with Dave Martin. Um, if you're in the area, stop on by. It starts at 8. Sign up. Uh, sign up sheet is usually up right after 7.30. So if you're there, I'll see you there. I might even do tomorrow's video from the dovetail. But maybe not. We'll see. Uh, until then, you guys have fun.